okay so we are inside the server of course this is just a random mode you can change the difficulty you can change the game mode and uh, yeah you can invite your friends so yeah this is it. everything works perfectly you can get the wood you can get everything so yeah uh, it works it just, it just works for me <laughs> okay Yo, what's up guys, my name is AFG Sonic and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Actually, it's not a Minecraft video today. <laughs> today it's a new tutorial video. I'm gonna show you guys on how to make your own Minecraft server uh, in Minecraft, basically. If you wanna know how to make your own Minecraft server in Minecraft, Bedrock Edition, then you have to watch the, this video, the whole video. It's basically simple, easy, and the yeah, fast way to do it. So if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. Also hit the bell so you don't miss anything and like the video if you enjoyed and learn something new. Also share it with your friends so they can also watch the video. So without further ado, let's get into it. So what we have in here is, all you need to do is you have to have the internet, any browser, you know, I'm gonna use Google Chrome here. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna use it right here. So basically when you go to Google Chrome, just type in Minecraft, server free and the first thing there are actually many many uh, websites that you can uh, go in and uh, yeah I don't know what the freak is that, but, uh, yeah yeah there are actually many websites that you can go in but uh, I just used the first one and this is how I like figured out on how to make my Minecraft server so just type in Google Minecraft server for free and then type in this the first one which is called Eternals Minecraft server and uh, it's, it's gonna say okay so first of all this video is not sponsored by any kind of website this is just my own opinion on how to uh, to make a server you know uh, I just found this way to uh, make a server and I thought of I thought of helping you guys uh, yeah so you can try to, to get your own personal micro server as it says right there and it's also for free and all so yeah so what you need to do is just click play right there and uh, yeah just wait for a little bit uh, depending on your internet connection so yeah okay as you can see there i have already my uh, server right there it's for bedrock 1.16.20 and uh yeah i already created my server here so uh how are you gonna do yours is i need to log out first okay so uh when you press play this uh, web page will appear all you need to do is get and click sign up and then uh, you wait for the next page and then you're gonna choose your uh, username that you actually want so uh, you just use uh, or choose your username and you just agree that your personal data is stored and processed according to the privacy policy and just, just, just enable that and uh, yeah just use any username you want to use okay i don't know how many people just used my uh, this username is called potato986 for <laughs> I finally figured out of how to uh, like figure out the usernames to use for this video so yeah just click next after choosing your own uh, username and uh, yeah it's gonna wait for you and uh, yeah after that you can sign in with Google or you can just put the password or I mean yeah just you just you just can put your password and you don't even have to put your email just optional as it, as it says right there okay after typing a random password of course it's not gonna be random it's gonna be <laughs> you need to remember your own password so yeah I'm gonna just do that and I'm gonna be right back okay just click sign up down there in uh, the blue thing that you just gotta wait and there you go you just uh, you just have to create your own server by clicking create a server so when you click on that it's gonna give you the uh, uh, the options of uh, creating your own servers uh, which like uh, version you want which like bedrock or java as you can see there yeah so yeah as you can see there we have the uh, the what is called the, the port or the address of my server so we're just gonna use bedrock windows 10 mcpe and it also asks you and says that you can also change this uh, later so you just gotta click on create and uh, you just gotta wait for the next place to the page next page to load okay after loading the next page it's gonna tell you this uh, as you can see there I have the URL which is um, we don't care about that actually there is an address of the over there as you can see here this is the address it's called potato whatever this this thing is and also don't forget about the port you're gonna use the port it's not gonna be the default port right there 
I'm gonna highlight it like this. And you can have 20 players. I, I don't think... I think you can, like, uh, make more players to join your uh, server. But, uh, yeah. After doing that, all you need to do is copy the address and the port and then go to Minecraft. But first thing first, you have to click Start. This makes your uh, server going to start. Uh, do you want to agree to the EULA of Mojang? Just click Yes, of course. And, uh, yeah, just gonna wait a little bit until you start your own server and it's gonna give you eight minutes until somebody joins even you or uh, anybody else so yeah okay i forgot to say this but you can actually change the version right there or the software that you are using so uh i actually have 1.16.20 this version right here i'm just gonna use it so also i'm gonna show you guys this is how you uh change your own uh version it's gonna say yeah uh it's it changed right there and just change it click with the uh, what is it called the sign the right sign if we call it so yeah anyways guys I'm just gonna copy the address and the ports inside of Minecraft and I'm gonna be right back okay as you can see there we got the server name the server address and the ports they are all right so yeah all you need to do is get uh, save click on save and uh, yeah it's gonna tell you that the server is over there but before you join make sure to go back to the website and uh, click on start the start button okay as you can see there we have got the offline um, thing all you need to do is click start and click this again and uh, yeah it's gonna wait for you waiting in cool so all you need to do is go in and after that it's gonna ask you if you're gonna confirm that that is you so we're gonna like, just do that and gonna be right back Okay, so as you can see there, I'm going to the uh, the join server, but it's not gonna let me join until after I confirm that this is me. So how I'm gonna do that is go back to the uh, original thing, which is this. I uh, think after a minute or so, it's gonna ask you if you wanna confirm that this is you. Three days later. Oh my God, you guys! It took me like one hour to just get into the server. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good thing or not, but it, it's, it depends on your internet connection. Anyway, if you, after joining the server, as you can see down there, I have the split screen. Up there, I have Minecraft, and down there, I have the uh, website itself. After, after uh, clicking on join the server, it should appear something like this. going to see it in the picture because I couldn't record it. Uh, you have to click confirm now to, uh, to get into the server. So yeah, and now it's saying online. Really? Okay, as you can see there, uh, my internet connection is a little bit bad. But if, if it says online, actually, yeah, there you go. It's saying locating the server. So yeah, you have to make sure to click uh, on confirm now to confirm to confirm that this is uh, you and uh, nothing, no one else. <laughs> nothing else. And yeah, as you can see, we are getting into uh, my server, or the potato server. And yeah, it, I, I know it looks weird like that, but uh, yeah, just show you guys uh, in a minute, so yeah. Okay, so we are inside the server. Of course, this is just a random mod that we are just uh, joining, you know. So yeah, this is basically it. You can also change the mode creative or survival, but uh, unfortunately, you can't do it in the game. You have to go to the website itself and uh, change it the, the the things yourself. You know, you can change the difficulty. You can change the game mode, and uh, yeah, you can invite your friends to play with uh, with with you actually. <laughs> so yeah, this is it. everything works perfectly. You can get the wood. You can get everything. So yeah, uh, it works. It just, it just works. So yeah, that's it. Okay, as so you can see there, it gives you like four minutes. Uh, over there as you can see the timer and that's because oh now it's two minutes yeah if if there is anybody in there you have to uh, like uh, okay just click to restart you have to be in there because if you are not anybody in there if there is nothing no one in there the server is gonna restart or it's gonna shut down so if you wanna change anything else go down here and then click on configure your server also you can install a server software if you want to add add-ons or stuff so yeah, you have to click on the configure server if you want to. Yeah, there you go. You, you can change the uh, slots of the players. You can, for example, let's make 25. Also, you can change the game mode if you want to make it creative. Uh, change the difficulty to normal. 
And uh, yeah, you can do like a lot of sheet cheats and stuff. So yeah, uh, so yeah, that's it. You can change many stuff and many things. Just click on every uh, uh, save slot, and you will be uh, done for it. So yeah. So yeah, as you can see there, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This video took me forever to record. As you can see, there, my battery is now 12%. I started like 25. It took me forever to record this video. So yeah, guys, if you want to support me, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Also hit the bell so you don't miss anything. And like the video if you enjoyed it or something new. And tell me down in the comments if you have any issues because this is really this really gave me pain in the butt because it really took too long for me so yeah so i also shared it with your friends and yeah thank you guys so much for watching join the team and yeah goodbye <laughs>